Staber, a young 14-month-old Shepherd. No swings and singles. And the three doubles at the end. Morning Saber, ladies and gentlemen. We have Vicky and Sasha. Making it look easy. Here's Rocket Rocky, straight through the flames, no problem at all. Excellent. To the end. Lesworth Lady here. Here's Rogue. Big Saber once again. Once again, we're going through the last three. Here's Les once again. Shows you is a very skilled process indeed. Ladies and gentlemen, how to retrieve. Edwina Curry's favourite dog, is it? Not hard boys. Hard fresh this morning. And just to show what a soft mouth she has, a bit of quick agility here for Emmy. Oh, almost. The one's hatching out. Is it hatching out there? No more? No? Hello, oh, Remy. One, two, three. And just to show that it is not parboiled. We'll have the pH to resist almost in a minute. So good. It's an up and under and it's it didn't break, Peter! Oh well. Try it again, are we gonna win? <laughs> yes! Peter and Abby, ladies and gentlemen, Peter and Abby! How a man in the 19th century has worked with and the dogs assisted him in his everyday life. If you can imagine the 19th century Midwest United States of America, various breeds of dog in that area. There was cowboy and there was cowboys and there was people with sombreros on. Nasty, horrible looking people. There's not a safe place in the 19th century in the USA. Where are they taking them? We got the marshals. Hey, where are the good guys? John Wayne films always have good guys. Ah, uh, here's the good guys. Those hombres in the middle there, they've taken those squaws prisoner. They're after the reservation. And after anything else, perhaps, I don't know. Here's one coming out of the attempt there. He, oh, it's dangerous. He's getting away. Get that dog on him. There's Sam just going to take the man out. What a retreat. He's taking the man out. And here comes the deputy marshal. There's one of the long legs and the big cannon. He's going to... You get that dog? You better get him quick. Oh, what a take out by Jack. By General Jack with the marshal guy. General Jack takes no prisoners. He takes arms, legs, but he takes no prisoners. There's one more. Saber the bear. Making a short work of that ombre. He's down. You collect those guns there, deputies. Hey, there's someone else. Hey, hey, that's enough. He's injured. You're a medic. Medic, we have first aid in here. First aid. These people aren't brave there, well, we shouldn't let them believe it, should we? Here's the first aiders coming on there. There we go. We better make sure we get them back. We get them better before we hang them. Make them better, we hang them. Get them on the stretcher. No, oh, get them off the... Hey, the dog's injured. Put the dog on the stretcher. We look after animals at this next town centre. The hombres, they can believe it. <laughs> Hey, hey, just a minute. Sure. sure. General Jack, oh, General Jack's got him again. There's no peace for the wicked here. Not in Bonestone, Arizona.
That's having a keen look at this arm. Is it coming off? It's. Come on. Round them up, Sheriff. All right, Deputy, bring them all to the centre. Ladies and gentlemen, round of applause, West Langstone display team, the man work section. The goodies always win in the end. That just about rounds up our display for this afternoon. I hope you've enjoyed it. The dogs and trainers will be coming on just to say a fond farewell. So please, whatever you do, whatever you see, the dogs and the handlers do this afternoon, please do it under close supervised training. Do not do it at home. A few words to the audience from the dogs. A few last fond remarks. A few, a few brief barks from the dogs there. They're all barked out, I think. Thank you once again, ladies and gentlemen. You've been a wonderful audience. Have a lovely day here at Top Goals. The weather's on your side. Enjoy yourselves. Once again, West Lancs Dog Display Team, thank you very much indeed. Bye bye now. Ladies and gentlemen, the West Lancs Dog Display Team, your appreciation, please. <laughs>